Women used to talk while they were hanging t-shirts. Um, it was part of their drying clothes and they would communicate with each other. It was a way of socializing um, and they would also get into you know, conversations about domestic violence while they were hanging the shirts with their other with their friends. And so um, one woman suggested it to the other group of women to hang the shirts up um, and also write on them. I'm the facilitator of the clothesline project here um, and I've been doing this since my freshman year. So. In my freshman year, it was just students who were interested in doing this, but now, since last year, it's been the SMART team that's been sponsoring the Clothesline Project. The SMART team is the Sexual Misconduct Advisors and Resource Team, and so we have a hotline for students who are sexually assaulted, but it also serves as a resource for those students, and we also do trainings for students who want to learn more about sexual assault on campus. The shirts do say a lot, like very, very personal things, what each individual who has written on these shirts has gone through. And so maybe they don't understand what the shirt colors mean, but they at least can see what people are going through when they go when they write these shirts and the emotions and the healing process that comes out of putting these shirts together for the people who are writing them.